Hello and welcome back to the second episode of Team 90. And uh, this episode will be consisting of Spanish players. So you can see we've got Christian Teo, Rodriguez, Nolito, Trigueros, Soriano. And uh, we've got Gámez, Bartra, Fernández, Artuneche, Romero. And last but not least, Vadillo. So, yeah, this is just going to be a continuation of the last episode in which we did Southampton. And uh, we managed to win a couple of trophies. So, uh, yeah, like the uh, last episode, I will be discussing the pros and cons of the team. So, the first pro is the passing ability. As this team is Spanish, you would expect that the passing ability on each one of these players will be exceptional when they reached 90 rating and it was um they never seemed to miss pass or like misplace a pass i should say all the passing was quite smooth and uh, the finishing along with it was smooth as well we did hit the post a couple of times i think you'll see it in this clip uh as he crosses it in We'll wait for the corner to come in. So it's crossed in. Yeah, and then as you can see here, it's the post. That happened quite a lot um, during the matches. But other than that, the finishing was great from all the those players. Especially the front four, I should say. Um, Christian Teo, Rodriguez, Nolito and Vadillo. They were all just phenomenal they they could all pass the ball they could all finish they were all quick they they could all uh, make the the important runs and they kind of switched positions a couple of times which is what i liked about the uh, the team so yeah that was that's a not one pro another pro was the, the speed of the team everyone was really really fast so we could just blitz past each of the each of, of the uh, opposition and score the goals in quick success, succession I'm stumbling over my words here um yeah so this team was quite fun i i definitely recommend uh getting at least christian teo cuz he was the standout player for me uh, just the runs he made the the finishing just everything about him was was fun, fantastic. So, yeah, as you see, we lift the trophy. Soriano was the captain. Um, I would say, I would say Trigueros was the weak point of the team, and that's saying quite a lot because he was he played he played decently. Um, it was just when it came to defending, he wasn't up to scratch. But that's because he's a cam. So as you can see now, I've given the team a rating a five star because I think it was it's, it was better than the Southampton team by far. So yeah, I've given it five stars. So this is where I'm going to end the episode. This one's going to be a bit short. I think this one's shorter than the last the first episode. But if you enjoyed it, click the like button. And subscribe to see more of this series. Um, yeah, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>